Joshua had died. Without a strong leader, the Israelites began to disobey God and worship false gods. They forgot about the one true God. God was angry. He let an enemy king take over the Israelites, and they served that king for eight years. Then the Israelites remembered how good they had it when they loved and obeyed God. They cried out to him, Save us! God wanted the people to love and obey him. So he raised up Othniel to rule over them as the first judge. Othniel led the Israelites into battle against the king of Aram, and God helped the Israelites win. The land was peaceful for 40 years, and then Othniel died. Again, Israel forgot about God. God gave the king of Moab power to attack the Israelites and defeat them. The Israelites served the king of Moab for 18 years. The Israelites were sad. They remembered how good they had it when they loved and obeyed God. They cried out to him again, save us. So God raised up Ehud to save them. The Israelites sent Ehud to the king of Moab. Ehud had a double-edged sword under his clothes. He was able to stab the king of Moab. When he escaped, he blew a ram's horn and he became the Israelites' leader. God will help us defeat our enemies, the Moabites, Ehud told them. So the Israelites battled the Moabites and took control over them. There was peace in the land then for 80 years. When Ehud died, the Israelites forgot about God again. They turned away from him. When they remembered how good they had it when they loved and obeyed God, they cried out to him once more, Save us! So God sent a third judge to save them. His name was Shamgar. God rescued his people from their enemies, and he used the judges to do it. The judges saved the people from the consequences of their sin and their enemies who were overtaking them. But the judges could not save the people from sin. They could not make the people stop sinning.